Assalamu alaikum, hello everyone and welcome back to a new video from the Palestinian school in Qatar. In this lesson, inshallah, we are continuing talking about the 6th grade English for Palestine student book 6A with the first unit, my summer holiday. We will start with period 4, so please open your box page. Inshallah, we are gonna to discuss. We're going to discuss the first and the third activity, and we are going to skip the second and the fourth one because practicing on reading and speaking, you can practice them by yourself. We will take the first and the third. Let's start with the first one. The First one is about filling the gaps with the correct words. Look and complete the sentences with the correct words. We have one, two, three, four, five, six words, and we are going to put them in the correct accident, crashed, stirs, bang, fell, summer camp. Can you notice about the verbs? Not crash, crashed, not bang banged not fall fell what do you think they are not in the present they are in the in the past very good and we will talk about the past simple one in the next the first one amy had an accident at Summer camp. Very good. Amy had an accident at summer. Pause the video, try to answer them with yourself, and then uh, check your answer. Number two, what do you think, Amy? There's G space down the space. She fell down the stairs of the tree house. Very good. The third sentence. She spaced her head and arm. What did we say about the verb which comes with the head and the arm or the part of the body? It's banged. She banged her head and arm and crashed down into the flowers. So when you see head and arm, try to use the verb bang and crash down into the flowers. Very good. Let's move to the Activity, the fourth activity, and before we circle the correct verb, we are gonna to discuss them. We are going to discuss the past symbol. The past symbol tense is used to talk about a completed action in a time before now. Completed action in the past, something that we did and we finish from it. I did my homework. I played football yesterday. I went to summer camp last summer, and so on. How do we form it? We have some rules. You can pause the video if you want to write them down on your exercises. For regular verbs, we just add ed to the end of the base form. Happen, happened. Talk, talked, walk, walked, wash, washed. Just add ed to the verb, and we call this type of verbs regular verbs. Verbs that followed with ed, we call them to change them to the past. They are the regular verb. Happen, happen, talk, talk. For verbs that end with e, so the e is already here. We add just a D at the base form. Love, simply love. We didn't add, or we don't add another E. Just the same E and we just add D. Love, loved, like, like, arrive, arrived, and so on. For verb that end with a consonant and Y. What does consonant mean? All the letters are consonant except these five letters, we call them vowels. These are the vowels A, E, I, O, and U. 
you can draw them like this to like happy face to make them more easy the o the e the a the e the i and the u these are the vowels all the letters are consonant but these five letters for verbs that end in a consonant and y we drop the y and add i e b so carry carried we drop the i and we put i e d try drop the i and add i e d cry we drop the y and add i e d we have here an exception if there is a vowel before the y we keep it and simply add ed be careful here is the verb ends with y but there is a vowel before this y not like here the y and the previous letter is consonant not vowel so we add ied and we drop the y but here we have play we have a vowel when you see a vowel before the y keep the y and just and e d play played say said when you see a vowel for the y keep the e d what about the irregular verb there are many irregular verbs in english that don't comply with the regular rules so we have to memorize them we have to write them down and memorize them and practice them because usually they the teachers focus on them on their exams and you have to get to know them here are some of them break broke bring brought come came eat ate find found get got know knew make made and there are more than these verbs please pause the video Write these verbs in your exercises book and try to memorize them correctly. Let's move to the next one. We'll talk about the negative form. How can we form a negative in the past simple? Negative. The subject plus didn't plus the verb. She drank, didn't drink. The positive, she drank of coffee but the negative she didn't drink they didn't watch tv when we use didn't or did we don't use the verb we use the verb in the base form be careful okay she didn't drink we use the verb in the base form i didn't read we didn't sleep they didn't watch tv we didn't drink but she drank coffee they watched tv yesterday we slept last night i read a story or i didn't read and the last activity let's practice read and circle the correct words i think it's very easy after we explain the rule circle the correct words all the adventure that happened with amy was at summer time last summer last word like last or yesterday we use the past simple these are the keywords last yesterday or any date in the past rania missed amy in the summer in last summer or so missed Pass. Amy fell or fall down some stairs in the past at summer camp. Fell, very good. Three, she banged or banged her head and broke her arm. She banged her head and broke her arm. Or she crashed or crashed down into the flowers. She crashed down into the flowers. Because as we said, we talk about summer's adventure. We talk about Amy's adventure last summer. 
and by ending this point we reach to the last part of this video let's do this homework what is the past tense of these verbs please write them down and answer them and we will check our answers inshallah in the next video hope you enjoy watching thanks for watching and being here goodbye this is mr abdullah from the palestinian school in qatar assalamu alaikum wa rahmatullahi wa barakatuh